Today I'm gonna show you all how to round brush your hair. Anytime you put product in your hair, you wanna put it from your ears down. And then you wanna brush it in, cause then it gets all over, it coats all your hair. So I applied a smoothing serum in my hair and a heat protectant. I have thick hair and I, it's also um, wavy, curly. So I use a blow dryer that's about 1800 watts to be able to like smooth out your hair. So I recommend getting a, a decent blow dryer. And to start, I'm just gonna rough dry my hair to get it mostly damp and then I'll go in and round brush. my fingers as a comb to guide my hair. Again, I start on top of my ears and I'll come back. And I'll part it, bring it up. And I'm gonna use a metal round brush because once it gets heat to it, um, it helps smooth out your hair a lot better than if you were just to use like a boar bristle brush. I think a mistake that um, most people make is they try round brushing their hair with it wet. Just try getting it mostly dry and then round brushing. Also, if you round brush your hair down, you're not gonna get volume at all. If you lift it up at the root and round brush up, you're gonna get a lot of more volume. And something that I have not mentioned is when you're round brushing your hair, you wanna make sure that you're putting tension into the brush and when you're bringing it down with a blow dryer. And then you wanna make sure you touch your hair and make sure that it's all dry. You don't wanna leave anything damp because if you have any type of um, texture to your hair and you leave moisture in your hair, it'll end up looking like this after like, an hour. So I went over it. Now that I'm going closer to the top of my hair, I will start do using a cool shock. It smooths everything out and gives it shine. If you watched my previous video on how to curl hair, I shared with you guys that I had COVID and I had hair loss and this, all these little hairs are regrowth when I lost my hair. So my hair's like, thick here and then it goes to like nothing at the ends. All of that just drops down. We still have to blow dry it off.
Okay, so I'm done when I'm brushing my hair and I have a ton of flyaways because of just new hair growth coming in. And I always love to go in with a shine spray. For your flyaways, I'm using a hair paste. And you know that I don't like to put a ton of products at the roots of my hair because I don't wash my hair every day. I try to go like three to four days before washing. So a tip is don't put a lot of product at your roots. Deal with some flyaways and you'll be able to lengthen the days without washing your hair. I hope you guys like the video. Please give it a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.